So what's going on here? Uh, I've got an agility ladder. I've asked my friend Dennis Munier to help me learn some uh, methods on the agility ladder. He's a pro at this and I'm not. I'm an absolute amateur. He's a tennis coach and was a phys ed teacher at the junior high here in town. Now he doesn't know how to do things, but he knows how to tell others how to do things as well. <laughs> so let's get started and see how it goes. Dennis, you ready? Let's, I'm ready. Let's do it. Yep. So what's the first thing we're going to do today? Well, we'll just do the basic uh, to begin with. Uh, one step through, uh, one one foot in, one and then uh, two feet feet in, and it's just like walking or running. And then we'll get some of the other things going. Excellent. Let's let's let you demo it first. One foot in. It's basically, just running through. Okay. And then you go back. And the second exercise we'll do right after after we do our sets is two feet in. But that's pretty much all it is except you're moving forward. Now the good people can do all that stuff backwards. I'm not there. I see no reason to have to run like that backwards. But anyway. Okay. Right foot forward this time. Okay. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, much better. More fluid. That even felt better. That, that. Only took half a class period, Rich. <laughs> 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 okay, we're going to go. One, two forward, one back. One, two, one back. One, two, one back. So everything slows down, but you go two squares forward and then go back one. Okay. One, two, now back. One and two, now back one. Two, back one. Now we're getting the sensation of pushing off going forward and pushing off with a step back. I like that a lot. Okay. Oops. Two forward, one back. Yeah, well, the, the last two feet in, or the last time down and last time back, you did really well. So, okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, now we're going to get off. We're going to move a little bit laterally. Okay. So if you get on that side and face me, actually, let's get on right. Down. Come on up in the middle between the. Oh, I see. Yeah. Yep, gotcha. Okay, now all we're going to do is one, both two feet in each square as you're moving laterally. Okay, now, right, yeah, there you go. Now you lead with the right. My left. Or, yeah, your left, my right. Okay, now try to pick your knees up a little bit higher. Man, I'm all over the place. That's fine, you'll get it. Okay, and back. Two feet. Do the two feet in going down, just the basic two feet in going forward. Okay. We're going to mix it up just a little bit, a little bit quicker. Try not to let your feet stop. There you go. Okay, okay. now, well, no, okay. going back, do two up, one back. Same, just what we just finished. Still two feet in each square. Two feet, up, but yeah, two squares up, and now one back. Two up, one back.
Okay, now, down and back. Let's do the lateral step ins. Both feet in, okay. We'll just go down and back. Okay, yeah, pick your feet up higher. Therefore, you won't catch those bars. Okay. Okay, this next one, again, is going to be lateral. And we'll start here with your, let me see, it's going to be your right foot in. Okay. Okay, so we're going to step in and out. Just like a scissors kick or a scissors step. It's relatively slow. And once again, I'm not picking my feet up, so I got hung up. Okay, on my start ladder. with your right foot in. Okay, now step in and step out at the same time. Like this at the same time? At the same time, yeah. So I'm doing basically uh -huh. the cross. And now in with your right. Okay. So, so I'm starting, hang on. So I'm starting like this. And now, uh huh, yeah. Now you're just going right down the ladder. See those, your step, I mean, your left. Being so long, you, you might find it easier on mine with the smaller squares. Just more to trip over. I'll try yours. I mean, it because you don't feel like that you're so far away from the next rung. Try it. Okay. Uh, okay. There you go. Yeah. Now you. Okay. Yeah. You're you're getting it. Okay, so inside foot, so your left foot in. Okay, so now all you're going to do is exchange your feet. And you have to rotate your hips a little bit. We always talk about rotation, don't we, up at Planet Fitness? <laughs> okay, now this is a little bit quicker. I used to call this chop chop with when I was coaching. So in and out. Both feet hit the square basically at the same, not at the same time, but they're in the square at at the same time. And you're just, yeah, don't. When I come out, I need to come over here. Yeah, yeah, when okay. you come out, you have to try not to hop or go back too far because that will really throw you off. Let me just get the rhythm just, of what I'm doing. Yeah, so just walk in. Okay, hold on. Instead of taking that, okay, so you're here, here, okay, then here. So, let me see. Oh, I see. So, when I set up for the next one is after. So, when I come back from this, I come back straight. And then, and then back. And then, then over, oh. Or do I go up at that point? You go up. Uh, okay. Yeah. So, basically, I'm here. I come back, up, go up, back, come back, closer here because right okay. if you get too far away, then you're having to stretch, stretch and out. So far. when you come out, try to. I got you. When you're pushing off with your Show left, when you're you. pushing off with your left foot, you want to push that direction. Okay. A little more to the next. There you go. Now, yeah, now you got a, now you have a rhythm going. So, okay, this is going to be it's called hopscotch, but we add a, a squat to it. So, in, out, with a squat. Every time your feet come out, you do a squat. Now it's pretty slow. Both feet in, both feet out, every square. But when the feet come out, you do a squat. Okay, now try and keep your upper body as straight as you can on your squat. You mean upright? Upright, yeah. Okay. Don't lean over quite so much. Okay, same thing going back. Two feet in, two feet out with a squat.
This is called icky shuffle. Remember? You told me this is the gym the other day. Okay. I start on the right side, left foot in, right foot in. But only one foot comes out. The last foot just is a high knee. Okay. So, so start on the right side. So left foot in, right foot in, left foot out. Ready. This comes up and now, goes out. Now, now in. Oh, in. And now left foot in, right foot out, left foot up. Do I go okay. up to the next one? That's fine. That's fine because you're going to step in with your right foot. So that right, now the right foot, that last foot to come out always is a high knee. Now you step in, now in, out, high knee. Step, out, high knee, in, in, out, high knee. I don't know what I'm doing next. High knee, in. high knee. Yeah, you do the high knee before you go up. To now out, next, out with. Before you go to the next rung. Right. I got you. So, okay, right foot out. In. No, high knee. Oh, that now in. Rung. In. In. High out. Knee. Uh huh. Uh, okay, you're okay. <laughs> okay, now start with the left. So here, so in, in, out, knee. In, in. Out knee. Okay. I don't know too many upper body exercises. I know there are some. Okay. Most of them involve push ups and shoulder stability. Uh, I'll do a couple. I, I just don't really, on the ladder, I don't do much with upper body. It's more footwork stuff. And, but anyway. So if we start in a push-up position, okay, so it's you're walking, push up, and you try to get whatever number you have set as your goal. Now, people who do this a lot, they'll go an entire length of the ladder. I'm not there I'll yet. Lucky if I can do one. But, well, you know, go. So, okay, this, this, here, this, here, this. here. Now and push up? No, no, not yet. Get the other hand. Now do. Now. One push up. Now go back to where you started from. Push. Um, I know the ground's just a little bit wet, but no, because that motion works on shoulder stability. Uh, which is also upper body strength. Let me make sure I've got the time set. We'll do 30 seconds. Uh, let's go through it two times. And we'll get, I'll put a rest interval of 20 seconds. Okay, ready? Yes, sir. It will give us, I, I think, 20 seconds to get ready. Yeah, we're just getting ready. So we'll get in push-up position. And when the hear the horn, then we'll start. And the, go down two. Uh-huh, go down back. two and push up and down and then back. Okay. Okay, we get 20 seconds rest, we get to do that again. <laughs> Wasn't too bad, was it? Murder. Okay. So let me okay. go with you. Here. So I cross one foot. Step. And then that one came behind. If we go well, if you start out behind, then the next one is over. It's okay, always so opposite of what you start out with. So I'm you're going starting. over. Over in the front. Yeah, over, step, under, step, over, step, step under, under, step, 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 over. 
Now, this, this is engaging the hips because a little bit of rotation. Okay. Not much, but a little bit. So just remember, whichever you start out with. So, so if you, what I'm doing here. So if I start like this, now this one comes like this. Okay, now step. This, now, now this over. over. Now step. Into the same square or the next square? No, take your right foot, step. To the next square. Now over. I, I think I went over this time, so I'll go behind. Okay. Now step. This. this uh huh. This, so it's always the opposite. This, yeah. This. Right. You got it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Down and back this until two. the timer. Then we'll take 20 seconds rest, and then you'll go another time, 20 got seconds, it. and got we'll it. do that four times. Okay. Uh. Because we're going to do each one of these exercises four sets for 30 seconds each set, and I think I counted correctly including the push-ups, eight exercises that we went through. Okay, one foot run through. It doesn't make any difference which foot you lead with. Okay. This one. Two feet in. Straight run. So Two feet in each bang, square. Uh-huh. Yeah, and try to get your not necessarily high knees, but make sure it's, it's again like you're running in Stop place. Over the slats. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Next one, we'll start, you'll start with your left foot in, okay, and it's just both feet in, both feet out as you're moving down the ladder laterally. Okay, so when the right foot comes out, it goes to the side? Yeah. So I do this? Yeah, it's just step, step in, step, step out. Boy, going on ground is much easier than going on concrete. Well, much easier on the joints anyway. In, out with a squat. So that's it. That's our ladder workout for the day. One of us is really good at it and one of us isn't. <laughs> We're both improved. <laughs> I have plenty of room for improvement. So. Dennis, I really thank you, buddy. Oh, well, thank I, you. I, uh, Thanks for asking me to be part of this. Yeah. In any event, we go back a long time. Always been a great friend. Uh, so. He's probably the most fit person I know at his age, at almost any age. I see him in the gym all the time. But uh, been a huge help to me. Uh, not only does he know his stuff, but he knows how to impart it to others. So, Dennis, I thank you so much. Uh, if I need more help, I'll be glad I'll to help. You up, brother. Yeah, hey, <laughs> the, the geezer ladder drills. <laughs> that sounds like a great title for the video. Geezer ladder drills. Thanks, everybody. I'm thank Rich Reese, and I'll see you out there. Thanks, Rich.